Your phone rings. You answer it and you hear a panicked voice. It's one of your children or a partner and they're frantically asking you for money or asking you for some confidential information. The big question is, do you trust the voice that you're hearing? Are you sure it's who you think it is? Microsoft's Azure AI speech needs just seconds of audio to spit out a convincing deep fake. The register always has a funny take on things. There's no way this will be abused. So Microsoft have upgraded Azure AI voice speech so that users can rapidly generate a voice replica with just a few seconds of sampled speech. The system, which was already pretty good, is now even more worryingly accurate. This capability unlocks a wide range of applications from customizing chatbot voices to dubbing video content in an actor's original voice across multiple languages, enabling truly immersive and individualized audio experiences, Microsoft said. But it could also be a boon for people with goals that may be malicious or deceptive, and we can imagine audio deepfakes produced with the service becoming even more challenging to spot. Cybersecurity experts recommend that in your family, you have a secret password or keyword or something that only you know. How would a scammer get one of your kids' voices? Maybe they're posting videos on TikTok or Instagram or something like that. Or it could be something as simple as phoning someone's phone. When the call goes to voicemail, they can sample the voice, get a few seconds of voice, and then they can clone it with services like this. In addition to watermarks to make the generated audio easier to identify, but you can't hear it as a human, Microsoft insists all customers must agree to usage policies, which include requiring explicit consent from the original speaker, disclosing the synthetic nature of content created and prohibiting impersonation of any person or deceiving people using the personal voice. So as the register says here, that's all right then. Yeah, right. What a scam is going to do, they're not going to care. They're going to use it. In these tests, they found that 30 seconds of sample speech was enough to create something that was eerily accurate. And they summarize the fact that scammers are using this and have, for example, used it to scam senior US government officials as part of a major fraud campaign. Just because the voice on the telephone sounds like one of your family members or business partner doesn't mean that it's actually that person. It could be a deep fake using AI generated voice. Make sure that you have a passcode or a password of some kind that only you know so that you can ask them for that. And if they can't provide you with a passcode or password, hang up the phone.